We had a series of emails about this in the right? last week. The city of Phoenix making big changes when it comes to bulk trash pickup in its neighborhoods. This is for all those big yeah. and bulky items. And if you still want curbside pickup, you need to pay close attention. There are some changes coming your way on your side. Gary Harper's here to spell out everything we need to know. Yeah, a couple of changes. First of all, it doesn't begin until September 30th, okay. and this is only for people who live within the city of Phoenix. So if you're in Mesa, Chandler, or whatever, it doesn't affect you, only for Phoenix people. Now, one of the big changes requires you to put the bulk trash on the curb right in front of your house. There is no bulk pickup in the alley, so remember that. Also, the amount that you're allowed to put out is being cut in half, but it's not as bad as it sounds. It's a familiar sight every three months in Phoenix neighborhoods. City workers picking up old furniture, household fixtures, all kinds of bulky trash placed on the curb by homeowners to be removed. For years, Phoenix crews have made quarterly trips to every Phoenix neighborhood as part of its bulk trash collection program. But now the city is making a big change. With our new program, we're hoping that it'll be a lot more convenient for customers. Gisela Gonzalez is with the city of Phoenix and says they're changing bulk pickup to an appointment system. Now, you can still get your bulk trash picked up four times a year, just like the old program. However, now you can have your junk removed when you want it removed. There's no more waiting. Whenever there's any ongoing projects that they have, like they're able to call in and get those items picked up rather than having to wait for their quarterly collection or having to go to the transfer station and drop it off. Right now, homeowners can place bulk trash on the curb up to 16 days before pickup. But under the new program, you'll know exactly which day the pickup will happen and you're allowed to put it outside a week in advance. That means the city can schedule the pickups more efficiently while minimizing the time the trash is sitting on the curb. With our new program, we'll know specifically where the piles are located and how many um, scheduled appointments we have for the day. So it'll just make it easier overall to make sure that you know we're getting to those piles by the end of the day. And the city of Phoenix is addressing one of their biggest complaints they get from customers. People say they don't want trash piled up around the holidays, like Halloween, for example, when kids are out on the streets. Major holidays will now be blocked out in the scheduling calendar to keep sidewalks clear and safe. All right, the new bulk trash pickup program starts on September 30th. That's when you'll start be able to make in your appointments and um, you, they'll have like a portal of some sort that you'll be able to log into and make your appointment. You can put it out um, on the curb seven days in advance, so it could be out there for a while. Um, now, let's talk about how much you can leave out there. It used to be 20 cubic yards. Okay. They're cutting it in half now. It's only going to be 10 cubic yards, and you're probably wondering how big is 10 right. cubic yards. <laughs> Think of a full-size pickup truck. Think of the truck bed. Okay. The truck bed is two cubic yards, so it would be oh. five tr uh, pickup truck That's beds. That's pretty substantial. That's a lot. Yeah, yeah. It used to be double that amount, but it's still a lot yeah. of, of debris and stuff that could be removed. Yeah, for sure. Thanks for clearing this up because yeah. I, I got, I think, six or seven emails yeah. from the city about this. Okay, so I'm glad you brought that up. Um, they're not trying to annoy people. <laughs> there is a, some kind of a glitch in their computer system, and they're like, <laughs> everybody is complaining. Okay, we've got it, okay? The 15 emails yeah. are enough, but they're still being generated. So it is a glitch. They're trying to fix Oops. it. Yeah. yeah, just uh, just delete the next one you get. All okay. right, I'm not annoyed at all because yeah. I, I I love this program. You yeah, know, I think everybody who owns a home loves it because you don't know how all this stuff piles up, but right. all of a sudden it's in your garage. You got to yeah. figure out how to get rid of it. Yeah, and it's four times a year still. Okay. okay, all right, interesting. Yeah, thanks, Gary. You bet.